Wow, we've covered a lot here, but we haven't talked yet about Hank, your dog. Hank. I would have loved to have him here to, with me today, which I sometimes do, but today he was like passed out, so I kind of left him to sleep. By the way, my dog Lou is doing the same thing this morning, and I didn't want to uh, disturb him, so I said, have the house. You deserve it. Have the house. That's kind of cool. How did Hank enter your life? Why was now the time for a dog? I don't know. I was always kind of, I wanted a dog for a long time, but I didn't want to just, like, kind of decide on it too quick, just, be like, just because I wanted one. I just wanted it to be in the right moment. But um, I kind of felt like... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't know why. It was just like, I was like, yep, I, I really want a dog, but I want to do it in the right way. So I did a lot of research before I did it. I'm sure a lot of people do that. Like, you know, like you start researching, watching so many videos about dogs. And you're like, I think I'm ready. <laughs> Funniest thing, first day he comes, I don't know what to do. I'm like, oh. and like, Hank's like, I'm scared of you. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't know. Why do I feel like, you know, I'm so like, un educated about it when i feel like i've studied for like the past month about dogs uh, by the way that is parenthood i think that is like it, it, that is being a parent or having a responsibility like like a, a responsibility that is a thing that is in addition to yourself do you know what i mean like whether that be a kid or a cat or a dog like this thing doesn't have thumbs you are hang's thumbs like he needs you for everything i know and it's like and like every day i'm like oh my god is this what i'll be like when i have a child <laughs> <laughs> it's the, weirdest the, answer thing. Is, the answer is could be but also like hank prepares you for that moment you know yeah i know i'm like oh my god i feel like i've already had a son so it's like next time like bring it on <laughs> which is weird I, I shouldn't be talking about having children right now but i don't know why it's like will i be like this when i have a, my first child <laughs> it's weird <laughs> By the way, I think the same thing all the time. And my friends will see me interact with my dog and let, let, let I'll let my dog run me, you know, like I spoil him. He walks me. I don't walk him. And my my friends are nervous for what a human child will be like that I help create. So. so true, so uh, true. I'm like, and I talk to him like, what's that? And I'd be like, baby, I love you so much. And I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> and people are going to think I'm the weirdest person. And the funny thing is, like, um, I always look at my dog and I'm like, he's such a genius. Like, I think he's a genius. Like, he's... <laughs> And yes. everybody's like, all he did was like sit down and like <laughs> hand. That's your, that's all he did. And what do you mean he's a genius? I am also convinced that my dog is the smartest dog, and he 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 can understand me. He understands words. And if he only had thumbs, he'd be able to r run the world. I'm convinced of it. So true. I totally uh, understand what that feels like. But, but by the way, like, see, this is a part of it. Like, don't you want to be your kid's biggest fan? You are Hank's biggest fan. Um, well, if I remember correctly, your dad wanted you out of the house at a certain point because you sang too much. But I'm assuming he's still your biggest fan. I hope so. I hope so. <laughs> I hope that is the case. Well, at least you, have, you probably have Alice, you know, your sister. and you, you have, Yeah. Brother. But you want to be your My, kid's biggest fan, right? Like your mom? I know. But then, like, now, like, recently, I've, I've had a lot of work. And so my mom had... Um, has been taking care of Hank a lot and so nowadays I think he kind of likes my mom a bit more and which like it actually <laughs> it breaks my heart I feel like so down when my dog kind of like wags his tail towards my mom and he kind of like ignores me I'm like ouch like I feel heartbroken like I think I could record a song right now I'll be like bring it on all the sad songs <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, I'm like, ah. I'm like, Where did ah. this emotion come from? My dog left me for my mom. <laughs> so, like, oh my god, it breaks my heart the most these days when he likes my mom over me. I'm like, but the truth is, when you're back in his life, there's nothing like your smell. My dog lived with my parents for two months, and when he saw me again, he, like, he, he freaked out. He peed himself. He was so excited because that's what geniuses do, I hear. Yeah. Um, Genius come on. right there. Geniuses pee themselves. <laughs> But yeah, he uh, freaked out. So there's nothing like your smell. Don't worry. He'll come back to you. Hank, Hank will always love you. I hope so. Thank you for saying that.